at the beginning. It sounded like it was a military coup or uprising. We began asking ourselves whether we should go out there and, and support that uprising. For that instant, people were of one mind. You get Marcos out, whatever it takes. We had been under martial law for 14 years, and people in a way had gotten used to martial law. President Marcos and his wife Imelda, they ruled together a very dark and cruel dictatorship. In 1986, Cory Aquino was prevailed upon to run against Marcos in a snap presidential election when Marcos cheated her out of the presidency this led to massive protests and a revolt of a few military officers who could no longer take uh, Marcos and, and his men. The people came out and protected the, the rebel army. It was like a, a huge uh, picnic, actually. Uh, I was there with my wife. I was there with our daughter, taking a gamble on, on, on freedom. We found our voices. We found a courage that had receded too far in many of us. But we knew that on the periphery of this movement were Marcus's massed forces who would, at one command, descend on us. It was the people you least expected, the nuns and the priests, women who took to the forefront and met the soldiers and the tank commanders with food and flowers. We were out on the street and there was a sniper up in one of the towers, uh, firing down, but not really at people, but, but on the street. People would scatter and then nervous laughter would be heard. And then we would slowly, giggling, crawl back to our previous position. No Filipino really wanted to kill a fellow Filipino. It was, just wasn't worth it. Marcos wasn't worth it. Defections took place by the minute, by the hour. Within the space of, of four days, Marcos would be gone. Mr. Marcos and his family had fled by helicopters under American guarantees. One of his generals gave me the first official confirmation. Has he left the country? I do not know, but he's no longer there. So Mrs. Aquino is now the ruler of this country? Yes. The nation just exploded in euphoria. It made me feel myself worth again as a Filipino citizen, uh, that I had something uh, more to live for, uh, for myself, for my family, and, and my country. <laughs>